بسم الله الرحمن الرحیم Here we see in detail an infectious disease acanth amoeba infection. First of all, we see what is an acanth amoeba. Acanth amoeba is a microscopic free living amoeba or amoeba is a single cell living organism that can cause rare but severe infection of the eye, skin and central nervous system. Then the amoeba is found worldwide in the environment, in water and the soil. The three diseases caused by acanth amoeba are acanth amoeba keratitis, insect granulomatous amoebic encephalitis and then disseminated disinfection. First of all we see acanth amoeba keratitis. An infection of the eye typically occurs in healthy persons and can result in permanent visual impairment or blindness. The causes of acanth amoeba keratitis is the amoeba can be spread to the eye through contact lens uses, cuts or skin wound or by being inhaled into the lungs. Most people will be exposed to acanth amoeba during their lifetime but very few will become sick from this expire. Then the symptoms of the acanth amoeba keratitis, eye pain, high redness, blurred vision, sensitivity to light, a sensation of something in the eye, excessive tearing. Here we see this is a healthy eye and this is acanth amoeba keratitis mm -hmm. eye. This is infectious eye and all the symptoms, symptoms is implemented on this eye. Then we see granulomatous amoebic encephalitis. First of all, we see what is granulomatous amoebic encephalitis. A serious brain and spinal cord infection typically occur in persons with a compromised immune system. Then we see symptoms of granulomatous amoebic encephalitis. Confusion, headaches, seizures, low grade fever, blurred vision, change in personality, problem with speaking, coordination or vision, one side of the body or face may become paralyzed. Here we see is an, a diagram. This is very important for the understanding of granulitis amoebic encephalitis. Then we see disseminated infection. What is disseminated infection? A widespread infection can affect the skin, sinuses, lungs and other organs independently or in combination. It is also more common in person with a compromised immune system. Then we see symptoms of disseminated infection. A cough, chest pain, fever, chills, night sweat, fatigue, joint and a red spotty rash shortness of breath. Then the treatment of acanth amoeba infection. Early diagnosis is essential for the effective treatment of acanth amoeba keratitis. This is the treatment of acanth amoeba keratitis. Several prescription eye medications are available for treatment. However, the infection can be difficult to treat. The best treatment treatment for each patient should be determined by an eye doctor. If you suspect your eye may be infected with acanth amoeba, see an eye doctor immediately. Then we see disseminated infections treatment. Skin infections that are caused by acanth amoeba but have not spread to the central nervous system can be successfully treated. Because this is a serious infection and the people affected typically have weakened immune system, early diagnosis offered the best chance at a cure. And in the last, we see the treatment of granulomatous amoebic encephalitis. Most cases of the pain infection with acanth amoeba are fatal. Thank you for watching. Like, share, and subscribe.